Oh, we'll get to the almanac in a second there, Jim. But yes, we had more record breaking tying temperatures today. 67 right now in Denver. We have 57 out in Greeley, 63 in Lamar, High Country, 46 in Frisco, 67 over in Grand Junction, and 67 from our weather watcher, Tom, in Centennial. Let's check in with our current temperatures downtown. We are at 72 degrees with 67 out at the airport. And our almanac for today, 77. So we did tie the daily record high from back in 2009. A really warm day today. We've had warm temperatures all week. This is actually the sixth temperature record we've tied or broken in Denver this week alone. So it's been a warm week for us. Uh, we could actually break uh, the daily record low uh, maximum temperature if we stay above 46 degrees by uh, midnight tonight. So we still have to wait uh, for that record. But again, it's been so warm for us. We do have some cooler temperatures on the horizon, though. We are dry right now in Colorado. But if we look up to what's happening up in the Pacific Northwest, there's some rain, there's some snow, there's some moisture. And and it will be heading our way, heading into Saturday. Some parts of Colorado, maybe Friday night, you start to get a little bit of moisture. Otherwise, we'll have to wait until Saturday for some areas. So this drops down toward Nevada, heading into Saturday and Sunday. As it does, it will funnel moisture into the western side of Colorado. And maybe some uh, showers roll into Denver Saturday night into Sunday morning. Then a little bit of a break. And then we could get some more on Sunday night into Monday. But this low pressure is a slow-moving system. It is going to start on late Friday night, Saturday, and then keep keep making its way through Colorado on Monday night. So again, this will not be a fast one for us, and we're expecting a lot of snow in some areas. We have a winter storm watch down in southwestern Colorado. Our eastern, or I should say our western San Juan Mountains could see two to three feet of snow, and again, that is from Friday night into Monday night. So this will be a multiple day event, one to two feet in the Lagarita Mountains. So again, we are looking at a lot of snow, especially in that area. To the north, we're still expecting a lot of snow, just not quite uh, in that area, maybe in that six to 10 inch range. So looking at our drought monitor, Great to get a good shot of snow in that southwestern corner. Our drop monitor updated today. No major changes for us. A slight improvement, but overall uh, nothing that you would notice too much. So again, two to three feet of snow is looking good. 44 in Denver tonight, 41 in Boulder, 43 out in Burlington. High country, we have 26 in Frisco, 33 in Aspen. And then tomorrow, still warm. 76 degrees in Denver, 71 in Greeley, 80s out on the eastern plains, 50s, 60s in the high country, 60s, 70s off to our west. And for our five-day forecast, Saturdays, uh, we are still warm in the 70s and very windy as that low gets closer to us. Sunday we drop down to the 50s and like I said there will be a chance of some late night rain Saturday into Sunday for Denver and then another round maybe Sunday into Monday and maybe we'll get a little bit of snow for us. Not much and it won't stick to the ground for anything but we could get some rain so we'll take what we can get. And those people with yeah. Telluride ski passes are pretty lucky. <laughs> yeah and the, the Wolf Creek down there they've opened very some rides. Yeah. Thanks. After Kayla